sometimes love hits you over the head. Or stomps you on the foot. We prove that friends can fall in love. That's right. Tony and Bobby were pals. Neither one of them was especially eager to get romantically involved. After all, they'd both been burned. Tony by Lucy. Oh, please, don't remind me. And Bobby by Jake. But Bobby and Tony shared the same ideals, the same values, and they both loved children. And in a way, our kids brought us together. On the day of Lucas's christening, I got up the guts to do something bold. I didn't want to give you this until the festivities for Lucas were over. A present? What is it? An opening. It may look like an old jar full of cotton balls, but it's not. Is it? No. It's a magical jar. And inside it is a special wish. And if you're pure of heart, you turn it upside down and that special wish will fall right into the palm of your hand. Don't rattle it, <laughs> upend it. Tony, what is this? What is this for? What it is is a ring. And what it's for is to become engaged. That's what it is. And it has a special wish for me that you accept it. Oh, Tony. <sighs> You're my best friend. Friends can become lovers. It's happened. Us? a love different than any love I've ever had and good and strong and beyond friendship. Will you marry me? I would love to marry you. as a symbol of our friendship. Love may be the spark that started the flame, but friendship is the timber that keeps it burning. So when you wear this ring, always remember that this flame keeps me warm when I'm cold and lights my way through all my dark hours that I will always love you and always cherish you and keep you for the rest of my life. Well, you just said everything I was going to say. <laughs> but I guess that's what happens when you marry your best friend. You are my best friend. My best and dearest friend. I love you very much. I feel real lucky to have you and the kids and family and friends. My heart is very full right now and I feel blessed. And I think we're both very fortunate, Tony. Because we don't have any illusions about one another. We're a lot alike in a lot of ways, but in some ways we're very different. But what really matters is, is that we still respect each other and we trust one another. And I think that's the greatest gift of love that two people can give one another. So, please accept this.
this ring. I know that I will love you for the rest of my life. You have spoken your vows. And now, with the power vested in me, I pronounce you husband and wife. And you may be survive. I feel like crying all over again. Tears of joy. I know we were so happy back then. We still are, right? Yeah. I mean, yeah. Kiss <laughs> me. I love weddings. Doesn't everybody? And we look forward to sharing many more happy walks down the aisle with you.